It was a situation agent Louis Cardina says that could have fallen into anybody's lap, but back in December it fell into his. And although at the time he did not realize that what he did was special, his peers honoring him with the highest award of their department. I heard some gunshots behind me two rounds go off. So I turned and uh, I was watching people run from Walmart and I knew that I had to go down there and find out what was going on. That moment happening back in December in Bakersfield while parole agent Louis Cardenas was checking on a parolee. What agent Cardenas heard, he says, changed the entire course of his day and natural instincts from his training kicked in. Unfortunately, now nowadays, the state of our country, uh, there's entirely too many shootings taking place in public places and I was pretty sure this was going to be one of those situations. Agent Cardenas quickly drove over and identified a person with a pistol in a shopping center parking lot in town. He says he was able to recover the pistol, keeping the Bakersfield Police Department in the know the whole way. And then I was informed by the, the witnesses that were running around that the individual I was looking for was inside, that another person had run inside that had fired the weapon. So I quickly got a description of that individual. I relayed the information to Bakersfield Police and I told them that I was going to go inside uh, and attempt to make contact. Ultimately, Agent Cardenas says he was able to get the suspect inside to the ground until backup from BPD arrived to clear the building. No one died or was hurt that day. The California Department of Corrections awarding him the Medal of Valor in a virtual ceremony on Friday. According to the CDCR, he earned the CDCR's highest honor, quote, by distinguishing himself by conspicuous bravery or heroism above and beyond the normal demands of correctional service. BPD also acknowledged his efforts. They, you know, they said they acknowledged, they said, hey, you did a good job. We appreciate it. And uh, it's good to have those guys uh, recognize me that way because they help me a lot on the street. I have the gang caseload and I'm constantly walking into houses that I consider extremely dangerous and we work alone. But even though his peers say what he did was heroic, Agent Cardina says peace officers are still human. He himself had a decompression process that his department offers and encourages fellow officers to talk about what they go through and how they felt. Of course, this one had a good outcome. So, uh, you know, a lot of pats on the back and a, a lot of high fives all around. And uh, uh, peer support and counseling is always, always important and nobody should ever shy away from that. If you would like to see Agent Cardenas receive that Medal of Valor in the virtual ceremony from Friday, we'll have a link to it on our website, turn to 23.com. In Bakersfield, Kristen Barton, 23 ABC News, connecting you.